Yo, what's good? It's Zavara here. I uh, just want to show you how to make a rolling techno bass. So we'll get our kick here. You want to find kicks that have a tail, like a long tail. Pretty much. That's the trick. That is the, really the trick. So I'm going to take this kick here. I'm going to go to cut itself. We want to make sure the sample doesn't overlap or it'll be bad. And right click again. Go to fill each four steps kick right now and now we need to put this on the mixer and you can click here to assign it back in here one or here click right here channel routing or route route selected channels to this okay so we got that now with this highlighted, with insert one highlighted, I'm gonna come down here to insert two, right click. We're gonna to go to route to this track. Now you have two kicks. So now what we'll do is we'll turn this one down. We'll press F2, and that's to quickly rename and insert or anything really in the studio that bass for that kick now what you want to do is in slot one of the bass going to add a fruity delay to see boom we're getting there already and you don't really have to do too much um, I, I don't really like to mess with the delay too too much but you know tweak it tweak the settings really tweak the settings but I, I like it like this so now what we need to do is actually add distortion so fl studio comes with destructor i'm gonna click destructor turn off the chorus and the speaker That's it. 